Parents and students in the Chihuahua School District are breathing a sigh of relief tonight now that police say a shooting threat to the district is not credible. Police say there is no threat to any students and the school district plans to resume classes tomorrow. Derek Strom spoke with the school district on how they learned about the threat. It doesn't happen very often, thankfully, but it does happen. Chihuahua School District Superintendent Jason Perrin says the school resource officer informed him about a shooting threat that was reported to be targeted at Jenkins Junior and Senior High School. He says the district's incident management team made the decision to close down all the schools in the district within 10 minutes. Since then, the district learned the threat targeted the entire school district, but police say that threat is not credible. We'll most likely have school tomorrow with police presence just to even, you know, if there's no threat, just to help provide some security and support for, for our community, for our parents and kids. Yeah. The district says it will also make school counselors available for any students or parents that have increased anxiety. One parent told us she was afraid when she got the phone call from the district about the threat because these situations are often much more serious than when she was in school. School resource officers helped inform the district early on about the shooting threat, and the National Association of School Resource Officers says hoax threats are something it sees often around the country. Uh, last school year, it, it seemed like they were just about every other day. Uh, they seemed to focus on one state at a time, uh, and anywhere from about 8 to 12 school districts within a state. Kennedy says a lot of hoax threats come from overseas, but his organization sees plenty of threats that come from students as well. He says every threat should be taken seriously by parents, students, and schools, and they should be treated on a case-by-case -case basis. In Chihuahua, Derek Strom, 4 News Now.